my advice to sort of any amateur would be to, I don't even know, I'd say consistency is key. I'd say try to, when you're working on something, I often see amateurs becoming uh, frustrated early. Us pros get frustrated as well, but if you ask most pros, uh, we'll work on a, one thing for six months to a year and you know, I'll play in a prime and see some amateurs sort of have a swing thought and then quit on it after two holes or three holes and then move to the next swing thought and then all of a sudden they're, they're back in the forest. So I think if you can try and be consistent, really listen to what your coach is telling you or whatever you've YouTubed online and try and stick with it for at least a month or two and then maybe try and see some results then. My most consistent swing thought, it probably revolves around tempo. There's a certain cadence I try to swing by. I feel when I try to work on things too much, no one can really see it on camera, but I'll start to take the club back too slow, trying to get into certain positions. I think there's a certain cadence in which you want to pull the club back to allow yourself to sort of load and then unload uh, the club into the golf ball. So my tendency is always to get a little bit slow and then I jerk down on the club and, or the handle, uh, which shuts it in my case with a lead, uh, a bowed lead left wrist. And for me, if it's a little bit more neutral, uh, since I like to hit a draw, it's a little bit easier when the face is a little bit more open versus down and shut.